I'm going to make a math quiz and I've already clicked on the new quiz button and I've entered my title and so I'm going to add my first multiple choice question. So I click on add question and choose choice and it's going to be a math question. So I have to click down here in the three dot menu and choose math. And what that does is you'll notice that it now has uh, an equation box that I can add an equation to. I can switch back and forth from equation to text. Um, back and forth, but I do want equation for the question and the answers. So I need to put in a fractional expression. So let's see, 2x, whoops, 2x squared, and I'm just typing in, I could use the, oops, sorry, 2x squared minus 2x uh, minus 12. I could be using the uh, buttons down here, but for superscripts, it's just as easy to hit the shift six uh, if you do it in the right place. Shift. <laughs> Whoa, should have edited that out. Uh, 10x uh, plus 3. Oh, see, now I did it all wrong. Uh, squared out of the, there we go, minus 10x plus 3. There we go. I've got the image off to the side here, and I'm looking at it and not paying any attention. I could be using the uh, buttons here, but it's just as easy to put in uh, the superscripts. Microsoft's kind enough to tell me what the correct answer is. Um, but I'm just going to go ahead. Let me do it by using the little bars down here so I can show you 3x minus 4. And then clicking. Well, I guess I'm not really using the bars because I don't need exponents anymore. Okay. Click OK. And the next one, 3x. Oh, see, I didn't do the fraction. I There we go. 2x minus 1. Click OK. Add another option. Fraction. 2x plus 4, 3x minus 1, click OK, add an option, 3x minus, oh, see, I didn't do it again. That's why I'm used to digital ink, 2x minus 1, there we go. Okay, so I've got all the uh, questions in, or sorry, all the answers in, and I have to just check to make sure that's the right answer. So if they get it right, they're going to get that nice. Uh, make it worth two points, and make it required, and it's good to go. Uh, hit share, copy that URL, send it out, and away it goes. Okay, hope that's helpful. Thanks very much.